fall made us turn within every time we hit the wall fed the fire to win i have a dream that one day this nation will rise up and live out the true meaning of its creed we hold these truths to be self-evident that all men are created equal. Because I've been to the mountaintop and I've seen the promised land. I may not get there with you. But I want you to know the night that we as a people will get to the promised land. Greetings. My name is Dr. Natanya Montez, and I serve as Dean of Student Affairs at College of DuPage. Thank you for joining us today in celebration of the life and legacy of the Reverend Dr. Martin Luther King, Jr. As the largest community college in Illinois, we pause to reflect upon the significant impact of Dr. King's work, both in making history and providing the necessary gateway to help shape the future. Members of our college-wide community from all walks of life have provided their insights on how Dr. King's commitment to social justice has impacted us all in many unique ways. We invite you to share your thoughts and continue the dialogue within a framework of Dr. King's words. The function of education is to teach one to think intensively and to think critically. Intelligence plus character, that is the goal of true education. And now, please join me in welcoming Dr. Brian Caputo, President of College of DuPage. Thank you. On behalf of the College of DuPage faculty, staff, and students, we are delighted to honor the legacy of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. on this special day. Without question, Dr. King was a visionary leader focused on the collective mission of achieving equality for all. Our annual recognition is significant not merely to highlight a movement that touched our nation and carved out an unforgettable mark in history, but more importantly, to shed light on the work that continues today in transforming lives through education. Our dedication to Dr. King's dream lies in College of DuPage's unwavering commitment to provide opportunities for students of all socioeconomic, religious, ethnic, and racial backgrounds. I am also proud of COD's values of respect, responsibility, honesty, integrity, and equity. These core principles serve as the strong foundation for providing our students with critical tools that inspire, inform, and prepare future leaders. We believe in our students and the power of education. And it is in that same vein that I invite you to now listen to the various insights offered by the members of our college community. From an array of different perspectives, we will hear how Dr. King's life and work impact the world today. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Natanya Montez and President Dr. Brian Caputo for your remarks. My name is David Swope and I serve as Manager of Student Diversity, Equity and Inclusion at College of DuPage. The life and the legacy of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. is rooted in the fight for equitable humanity in a nation that is constantly struggling with liberty and justice for all. The work of King sits at the forefront of anti-racist action, fair voting rights, and social justice. Unfortunately, more than 50 years later, the voice of King resonates in contemporary American society for the pursuit of life and liberty for many people of color. The power of King is that he saw love in the midst of hate, and he fought, and he bled, and he died 
for the political and social promised land that he believed possible for all Americans. King was truly a visionary. So next, let us hear reflections on Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. from College of DuPage's Interim Associate Vice President of Academic Affairs, Tamara McLean. And then she will be followed by Student Success Counselor, Devin Chambers, and then we will hear from our featured students. Following that, let us take a moment and acknowledge our 2022 Martin Luther King Jr. Scholarship Award recipients. Martin Luther King Jr.'s dream is still relevant today as it was 50 years ago. The legacy of who and what he stood for reminds me every day how much we need to keep being stewards of change and gladiators against injustices that still prevail in society today. Remembering that through his triumphs, his dream, and his promise, myself and others have benefited from privilege and access, and we owe it to ourselves and our future legacies to keep his dream alive. We must continue to have courageous and authentic conversations around diversity, inclusion, and equity. Hi, my name is Devin Chambers. I'm a counselor and the co-advisor to the Black Student Alliance at the college. So like many of you, I grew up learning about Martin Luther King through the textbooks and the I Have a Dream speech snippet. Uh, and that was the extent of which I knew about Martin Luther King and his values of unity. And I was fortunate to have parents who grew up in the 1960s and were influenced by these radical um, revolutionary movements and who fortunately taught me that Martin Luther King was actually a revolutionary and a radical in a lot of different ways of economic justice and anti-imperialism and all these values that even in his my, I Have a Dream speech, um, if you read the entire speech before the I Have a Dream snippet, he, he talked about, we need change now. Uh, we can't rely on leadership for change. It's on us to do it. It's that courageous Martin Luther King that even when the message and the movement is not popular, and even when he put his safety and his family's safety on the line, he still was courageous enough to act on his values and act on these moral commonalities and justice that I have tried to, uh, you know, envision and have tried to make a part of my everyday life. Dr. King's legacy means perseverance and determination. He was arrested 29 times, beaten while marching for Black civil rights, but never gave up. His example of nonviolence was a great example of self-control, but not to be mistaken as cowardly. Dr. King once said, darkness cannot drive out darkness. Only light can do that. Hate cannot drive out hate. Only love can do that. To me, like many other African-Americans, Dr. King was a voice for the people and a man who inspired people to fight for equality. His message for racial justice and equality set the tone for much activism nationwide. His peaceful approach continues to inspire how we approach problems today. There's so much fact about Martin Luther King that I love most. I mean, his um, religious background, his, um, his speech, I have a dream. I mean, it makes me feel that I also have a dream that I need to accomplish. And his I have a dream speech really inspires me a lot. Before I got a scholarship to come to the United States, I was supposed to give a speech to my people what I'm gonna do in the United States and what I'm seeking to achieve. And before I got, before I mounted a podium, I just put my hand on my chest and I said, I have a dream, I can do it. I think that if we take a look back at, you know, where we started talking about racial injustice and, and the fight for equality, we can see the evolution of the civil rights to the Black Panthers, to now we have Black Lives Matter, where it's really the same concept. We're still, you know, fighting for the same things and we're still using the peaceful 
methods. It has really kept me going because I always dreamt of being a leader um, as a person. And Martin Luther King's speech has really guided me through because he was a great leader. Initially, he felt um, he felt was going he was going to be misunderstood, and people weren't going to understand his speech, understand what he means. But he he had so much courage and confidence that he was reaching out to um, people, vulnerable people who wanted a chance of equality. That's what he wanted. And that's what a great leader should always focus on. Yeah. The core of his message and legacy was one that embodies the way of God. Love our enemies. Dr. King once said, I have decided to stick with, our, with love. Hate is too great of a burden to bear. King also stated, we must accept infinite disappointment, but we must not lose infinite hope. It's really the same concept. We're still you know, fighting for the same things and we're still using the peaceful methods where we're protesting and fighting peacefully, then our message for racial justice and racial equality and looking past our skin color and the stereotypes associated with that, I think that we can really keep changing the world and keep resonating with Martin Luther King's message and keep using his message to inspire us. The Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Scholarship Awards are given to College of DuPage students who promote academic achievement, service, leadership, and an awareness of social and cultural issues. These scholarships are made possible by the College of DuPage Foundation, the Center for Student Diversity, Equity, and Inclusion, and the Latino Outreach Center. Dr. King was a man that personified peace and social activism and led one of the greatest movements in world history. We are proud to announce the winners of the 2022 MLK Scholarships. Shaki Darko, Amreen Fatima, Aisha Flowers, and Amna Mia. We congratulate each student and hope the awards will contribute to their success. A very special thanks to our featured students, Martin Jonah, Darnese Springfield, and Shariana Cecil Day, very fine students, and we're proud of them. We'd like to give you a few announcements regarding the upcoming events for the Dr. Martin Luther King Acknowledgement, as well as our Black History Month events. On January 26, mark your calendar for keynote speaker, Clint Smith. He is an author, a poet, and a literary scholar, and we will be hosting him in collaboration with other community colleges on January 26. Then in February, we will hear more from our Martin Luther King Jr. scholarship recipients as they will share how the scholarship has impacted them along with the work of Dr. Martin Luther King and the influence that he has had on their student success. Also in February, College of DuPage will engage in a time of teaching and learning during our Black History Month celebration. This is an opportunity where we engage around the theme, Black Health and Wellness. And that theme is derived from the Association for the Study of African-American Life and History. So we invite one and all to join in on this teaching and learning experience. Engage, share, and learn as we go forward understanding history, being thankful for the present, and having a positive outlook for future success. Look for all of this information on the Student Diversity and Inclusion website. Thank you and have a great rest of your day.